let's say you are the writer of this particular document that spans over hundreds of pages but you have made a mistake of putting in a wrong date over here but you have repeated this date on many a pages in the entire document now you don't have to go to each page to make the necessary corrections rather you can do it with just a few clicks using find and replace option likewise you can change the headings fonts styles and many other options so let's dive into the video to see how we can do that here you can see i have this document consisting of four pages but this date 15 may 1990 was entered wrongly this was not the date supposed to be over here and you can see it has been entered on multiple places in the document in order to replace this date with the correct one we will go to home tape and on the right side you can see we have this option find replace and select if you click on find over here in the navigation you can enter this date for example i can copy it right from here like this Control c and let me put it over here Control v and let me press enter and you can see there are 24 iterations of this particular date let me close this navigation pen right from here again i would go to this option replace you can also go to find and replace by pressing the shortcut Control plus h so this is the date i need to find which i have already entered so what you need to do first you need to enter the date over here like this and then go to the option replace with let me put in the correct date and the correct date is 14th august 1996 since you have entered the correct date over here now you can simply click on replace again click on replace replace and you can see it has entered the correct date over here in order to make all the replacement simply click on replace all and there you go here you can see it says we have made 21 replacement let me click on yes okay close it from here and there you can see it has made all the replacement 14 august 1996 14 august 14 august 1996 and so on let me press ctrl z to undo it it was just a demonstration to show you how we can actually do that it's not just about replacing the dates or the words you can also change the style font or even formatting of the document as well let me click on replace again let me clear both the option find what and then replace with as well right over here you can see we have many other advanced options as well if you are interested you can try them out as well now let me change these chapter which are in bold style and italicized so i would keep my cursor right over here in find what search bar then go to this option format go to font option and i want microsoft word to look for this particular formatting which is actually italic bold and its font size is 11 so i'm gonna put it over here 11 so this is what microsoft word would look for in the entire document so i would click on ok next I'm gonna keep my cursor right over here in the replace with option I would go to format option and I would go to style and I want it to be replaced with heading one characters I would click on ok now let me click on replace all and there you go 10 replacements made let me close it and there you can see the entire document has been reformatted with the kind of formatting I was looking for. Let's say I want to change the color of this date and I also want it to be underlined as well. So again, I would go to replace option. So over here, I would enter the date like 15th May 1990 and I would replace it with this one, which is, let's say it's 20th may 1996 and i want a little bit tweaking of the formatting as well so i would go over here make sure that your cursor is right in this replace with search box now go to font option and let me put in a font color which is this one and i want it to be underlined with double lines and i want its font size to be let's say 12 and the font should be new times roman and if you want you can also make some other changes as well so let me click on ok click on replace all and there you go 
all done we have made a 24 replacement let me click on ok and uh, there you can see it has done all the replacement it has changed the date to 20th may 1996 although it does look quite a messy but it was just a demonstration to show you what can be done with this find and replace option as i mentioned there are some other multiple options as well. You can try them out on your own. So that was it for today's tutorial. I hope you have found this tutorial useful. Please give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel and thanks for watching.